You... Me? Oh, he was pointing at someone, not shaking his fist. It's hard to tell with their little... their little stumps. How's it going guys? My name is Graham and welcome to Holy Potatoes What the Hell. There's also been Holy Potatoes, a weapon shop, and we're in space. I haven't played any of them, but I always thought they looked super cute. You play as these goofy potato people. The other games are like simulators, like a, a weapon shop tycoon, and then a space sim of some kind. This one I think is a cooking game. I really don't know a lot about it. I've always just been kind of like mildly interested in the series, so I wanted to give it a shot. The kitchen. It gave me life. Though your potatoes, so it seems like a risky place to be. But it also took my life, exactly, and everything I ever had. This is what I was expecting. The kitchen seems like a place a potato doesn't really want to hang out in. Unless these potatoes don't eat potatoes. Depends if the entire world is potatoes or not. Ah, that hurt. That's a nice smell. From there? Oh, there's a nice smell. Did this potato just get cast down into the kitchens of hell? Where am I? What is this place? Hey, hey you! Yes, I'm talking to you. Why are you wandering about? It's time to fall in. Oh, no. What, what, what's your name? My name? Oh, wait. Oh, that's right. Memories wiped. What do you want me to call you? I get to pick my own name, hey? Sweeney Toots. Oh, it's probably Tots. Like, Dater Tots, not Toots. That little mistake there is going to determine my name. Instead, I'll be Sweaty Toots. Name of your restaurant? Toots and Poots. Sweaty Toots, that's an odd name. Whatever, get in line. You're late enough as is. What? Are these like prisoner outfits? What's going on? Listen up. Fresh Batch. My name is Timey Brock Oliver. And <laughs> instead of Jamie. And I'm the sous chef, something or other. First things first. Welcome to hell! That's right. Y'all are dead. D-A-E-D. -E Kaboom, squished, mashed. Uh... No, I'll just... Uh, they're from hell. I'm gonna let that one slide, I think. Don't give me such sad faces, my pets. Life after death can be joyous. Especially now that you're under my charge. <laughs> so anyway, yep. Basically, y'all are given a chance to prove your, prove your worth down here. As... Chefs! For some reason. We're gonna be cooking? Yes! And all of you will be assuming the role of gatekeeper chefs, the unholy protectors of hell. Wait, why aren't you changed into your uniforms yet? Are these stylish stripes not our uniforms? Let me just do this. Ah, fun! Much better. A lot of style down here in hell. The lot are now in charge of processing the sinners through various methods of torture. Why aren't we getting tortured or anything? Which includes frying, boiling, mashing, baking. Ah, that sounds absolutely D-L-E-E-S-H-O-U-S -E -E delicious. You'll be going through the nine circles of hell. The first circle is right where we are now, in limbo. The second circle is a fry station. <laughs> this is where sinners wander about aimlessly, for their sins are too small for the deeper levels of hell, but too big for the clouds of heaven. You may think, oh, this doesn't look like hell. Where are the demons? Where are the fiery flames of purgatory? Well, not every circle's the same. Some of them can be somewhat pleasant. The mainstream media only ever shows the circle of anger because they deem it to be the most hellish. Pah! If you spuds are lucky, you may just get to visit the other circles and see them for yourselves. Yes, y'all be slogging around in this hot, stuffy kitchen right over here. Follow me. Hey, you! Mmm, yes? Hi! Wow. You seem vegil. You seem like a nice person. This is Dante. I met her just now. Hi, welcome to the Circus of Torment and Misery. No, Dante, that's not the right attitude to have on your first day. <laughs> just treating it like a new job. What's your name? I'm actually Sweaty Toots. Ooh, I could also say Megasaurus Rexor, and why are you talking to me? I'll be honest. Nice to meet you, sweaty toots. Wait, did I do sweet? Is that sweat? <laughs> I know that both of you might be a little confused right now. I was too when I first got here. Don't worry, it'll be fine. We just have to follow simple instructions. Got it? Good. I know you all are new, but I expect nothing less than perfection. 
Especially if you're under my command. Was I a chef? Up above? Oh yeah, I was. I was, wasn't I? Right, so here's your first ta task list and objective of the circle lads' aprons on something or other. They run through this a little too quickly for me. Uh, oops. Did you get everything she said? No, honestly, I didn't. <laughs> no matter. I'm kind of familiar with how things are run. I can show you guys the ropes. Well, I mean, we're cooking. I need you to show me how to cook, not necessarily the ropes. First, we need to sort the evil potatoes. Click on the pit. Level 1, the Pit of Judgment, a literal hellhole, gathers only a handful of sinners. This is the Sinner's Profile page. It shows you all the information you need about this nasty spud. I seduced my secretary. She was hot as pepper. <laughs> Tony Starch! And then I have no idea what his different point things are here. Over here states the sinner's name and what heinous crime he or she has committed. And here's how the potato, this potato sin is measured. Malice, pride, greed, apathy. Now, let's assign the sinner to our punishment stations. The friar will turn our sinners into fried potatoes only if the malice stat is higher than 50. Hover over the station to learn about their requirements. Simple, simple enough, right? Hey, there you, there you go with Tony Starch. Now let's do the same for the rest of our stations. Remember, hover over to check their requirements. It's probably over 50 of the different colored things that they are. Pretty straightforward. We got Lara Craft. I raided a tomb. <laughs> it looked like fun. Well, are, is this also a fryer? There's a basic pot, uh, a fryer, basic oven, and basic masher. Well, you're going into the pot. You're just getting boiled. Peter, parkour. I killed my uncle. He tried to teach me about power. Sorry, but that gets you mashed. Good job. The center is an excellent match for that station. Just keep sorting certain centers. Fantastic. Just one more to go. Joan Snow. I slept with my aunt. I know nothing. And into the oven you go. Look at their little potato soles bouncing out into there. Wow, you're a natural. Time has been frozen while you were sorting. Let's resume to start the process. Press space to unfreeze time. Okay, they're just processing. So they're just working on cooking right now, right? Congratulations, you have just generated your first batch of ingredients. Oh, there's a step after this, is there? This tab shows your ingredients, ingredient stock. Keep generating ingredients during prep time by committing potato people's souls to various... Fryers and things like that? Very peculiar way of getting ingredients. Who are we feeding all this to, by the way? Keep sorting. Service time is coming soon. We got Marcus West. I blackmailed a teacher. It was an opportunity of a lifetime. I, I, can, I can kind of pick and choose where some of these people go now based on what I'm low on. It's service time. Shit. <laughs> I guess I should have been sorting a little faster. Looks like we have a guest god. A guest god? He wants potato soup. Oh. We just got like a Loki potato who just showed up here. Your first customer seems like a trickster. Better get his order right. Blessings, no blessings unlocked. Mm, level up gods to receive their blessings. Mm, so the gods just come come to the first circle of hell to come eat some delicious potato-y dinners. Let's find potato soup recipe in the book. It's right here. I got it. These are the ingredients needed. I need uh, whatever the loaf one is. A baked potato probably. And I don't know what the the cube is boiled once you have better ingredients later on you can click on the icons to change its quality ah because right now it's just okay eventually I can have better now we have everything in place let's start cooking click on cook get him some soup going keep in mind the patience level of the gods if they run out of patience they will penalize you instead mm, okay I can keep generating new ingredients that's good Veronica Ali I cheated on my grandmother it was fun you what I cheated on, on my brother. Oh, I got a D. Dish is done. Mm, smells amazing. I only got a D on it, didn't I? Let's visit the god altar to serve his food. Click on the god. Now let's complete his order. Present as tribute. Yay, you have been awarded with favor for the good service. Favor is given by the gods when their order is complete. If you fail the order, you will lose favor. I like having the favor of the gods. I want to be on the gods' good side as much as possible. Keep collecting favor to finish the objective. You need at least 20 favor by the end of the day. Can I just end the day now? <laughs> and that's it. We've completed this stage. You seem to be getting the hang of it. Let's start our real shift. None of that has been real so far? Goddamn. You there. Help me take a photo. Uh, sure. 
Does Loki just want a selfie? Make sure to get my good side, yeah? Oh, all sides look good. You look handsome as hell, Loki. Nice. Nice dance. I'll not tell anyone that that's what you were doing down here. Let me see. That isn't the right angle. You... Me? Oh, he was pointing at someone, not shaking his fist. It's hard to tell with their little... their little stumps. Take another one. Ah... Uh, just... Quit moving around, man. It's hard to get the right angle when you're dancing like that. Let me see. Mm, this isn't too bad. You, give it a try. Just get everyone in there. Oh, it's me. I'm the one who hasn't yet. Portrait mode. Use a potato dog filter. Or zoom in till his face fills the entire screen. That's probably his best angle, right? He's, he's just so in love with himself and his face. <laughs> Let me see. Did that work? This isn't bad at all. He loved it. Sweet photog skills. Uh, can we get you anything to drink, sir? Hmm. Call me Loki. Or THE Loki. Oh, aren't you the son of Odin? Hmm. Oh, you know my old pops, eh? Of course. I've heard whispers about the ruler of Valhalla. Valhalla is a real thing in this potato world? Yep, I'm the infamous, or should I say, Instagram famous adopted son. Whoa! I like you guys. Just palling it up down in hell. <laughs> I'll upload the pic on Instagram for my followers. You guys are bound to have an influx of customers soon. <laughs> oh, good. Which hashtag do you want me to use? Alright, I'm very confused about one thing here still. How come when I was cast down to hell, I got to be a chef? That still hasn't been made clear to me. I have no idea why I get to be a chef and not just a sinner. Hashtag toots and poots. Hashtag sinfully amazing. Hashtag num num num. Let's go sinfully amazing. Of course, I'm gonna add hashtag Loki. Hashtag Loki is for some fun. Loki for looking for some fun. I couldn't read it. Oh wait, wait, wait. I could I could bring this up though. Uh <laughs> Loki for some fun and up all night to get Loki. Okay, I'm actually glad I went back just to catch that one stupid joke there. And done. No need to thank me. I wasn't planning on it. I'm planning to kind of do my part for the community. I'm planning on kind of committing to being uh, a citizen of hell. And so I'm not going to do things like say thank you anymore or please. All my potatoes will be undersalted. They'll be served cold. And you'll have to ask at least two times when you want uh, your water to be brought to the table. <laughs> Nothing will be convenient. Well, this is hell after all. Hmm, that's real nice of you. Oh, and about the drink, a ba ball Baileys, please, on the rocks. Like, I'm trying to bail? Bail, is that how you're supposed to say that? He's, I should know that from Diablo, but he's saying like a Baileys. Item unlocked. You obtained new logo items. Fun? I guess I, guess I could build a, a logo for my restaurant here. Oh, I just, I, it's paused. That's good, that's good. What, what are some of the things I can do here? Storage. And stove of anguish, the pit of judgment. Okay, it's quite full. Oh shit, so that means there's 40 souls in here? I blackmailed my husband because I was salty? <laughs> She's asking it like it was a question. I frightened an alpaca. I was forced to? Is everyone just trying to provide excuses? I blackmailed my girlfriend. My mother told me to? I'm trying to I'm trying to split things up equally. I farted on a lawyer. I was sleepwalking. <laughs> <laughs> I destroyed a delicious cheesecake crepe. I relished the idea. Oh, all of these are, are busy cooking. All of these have someone someone's soul in them that you can only do one at a time. So I guess I get them brewing. What are you looking for right now? Is he, has he not actually technically asked me for anything? Uh, I got... Good, everything's done. Now I can start sticking things around. I guess I, I want to be fast about things here and I can't really be... New order, he wants french fries. Uh, I can't really be spending too much time. Do I have two of those? Yes, I do, great. I can't spend time reading every single thing that these people have for me. I gotta focus on like completing orders and things like that. New dish done, french fries sprinkled with copious amounts of salt. Too much salt. Earlier I said I would undersalt things. These are too much salt. That's how I'm gonna make them a little bit evil still. Hey, it automatically pauses when I bring up the whatever you would call this, the, the Pit of Judgment screen. I abducted a snow leopard. I enjoyed it. Bruce Paul, he's not even pretending that it was like any sort of... that he has any sort of regrets or anything. That's just how it goes. Uh, I think your fries are ready. Present his tribute. Do, do you like that, Loki? Praise the devils. This is amazing. 
I'm glad you like it. Oh, you, are you seriously going to ask for something again so soon? Uh, luckily, I have what it takes. What would it take to rank up the dish? Possible dish, possible dish rank. Use higher quality ingredients to get a higher rank. Okay, so this is the range I could potentially get. I... All I have is okay ingredients. I can't I can't improve on that. That's all I got to work with. Split you up again. Mm. Oh, we can just barely make that. And barely made the cutoff again. Perfect. I'm getting a very nice equal distribution here on everything. New dish done. Is it going to do that every time I finish a dish? Or it's just because I've never made potato skins before. So it's like a new specialty thing that, that I have never done before to present. Finally, my food is here. Dude, I literally gave it to you within like seconds of you asking for it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you can chill out for half a second. Ugh, why are you so hungry? Such a hungry god. What a big boy. Wow, it cooks things fast. Mashed potato balls. Perfectly rounded and shaped to perfection. Wait, did it just say that it was perfect in two different ways? Sure, why not? Level 2 Loki. Station processing time. Minus 2% or it's 2% faster whichever I'm, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to read that I'm guessing that means all of these Will be 2% faster They do they break eventually 99 out of 95 That's the number of different potato people that I think I've stuck in there so far. I'm thinking that Eventually they're gonna crater on me and then I'm, I'm gonna have to like go deal with repairs uh, perfect. Always a perfect split. I'm getting real great at that. Potato sandwich. I have literally in my life never eaten a potato sandwich. That doesn't really sound like a really great thing to me. I'm trying to picture what the hell it would be. Nothing like carb on carb to start, to start your day. Is it like a BPT or a BLP? Bacon, lettuce, and potato? That doesn't sound like a great meal. I think that's kind of kind of overkill. You're really overdoing it. I don't think it sounds very good. My god. Now, I, I can't I can't keep up with all your orders here, man. And luckily, there's only the one of you right now. I'm assuming the next step of the game will be to have to deal with, like, many... You can just hear them scream as they fly out into the cookers. I assume I'll have to be serving, like, several gods at once will be the next layer of challenge that the game adds here. And we're done the croquettes. It's really not Crockett science. That's brilliant. That's the best. There hasn't been enough potato puns in this game yet. That one's good enough to be an episode title, if you ask me. Center sorted, dishes cooked, orders completed. Favor earned 100, and starch 10% favor. Woo well, let's go to the next stage. Move on to the next stage of your adventure. Are you ready? I would say that I am. Ooh, speed bonus. Because I did everything so quickly, I get 40... Schmeckles? I don't know what the I don't know what they are. I don't know what this currency is, or in what ways it'll be important. Phew, how are you guys holding up? Fantastic, not too bad. This place is a literal hellhole. Nah, that went pretty smoothly. Loki and I are palling around. We're getting along pretty well. You guys seem alright too. I'm kind of enjoying my time in hell. I'd say fantastic. Keep it up, sweaty dudes. I forgot that's my name. I'm sure there's a reason why we're doing this, so let's do our best. Oh, oink. I don't, I, I don't know. Was I supposed to oink or say it? Did you hear that? Oink, oink, squee. They, this is pig, this is pig fingers. Hmm, sounds, sounds like it's coming from somewhere nearby. It's a pig bat for some reason. Ah, I think he's adorable. I love it. What is that? Uh, looks like a bat. It's clearly a pig. Uh, it's debatable. Where's where's my bat pig option? Because it's it's definitely both. Kind of looks like a bat too. I mean, it has wings. Mm, oink. I hope he's a helper. I hope this guy sticks around. What a sweetheart. Can we keep him? Is she dabbing around on this this bat thing? Bacon. Mm, I should stick to a theme here. I'm sweaty toots and I work at toots and poots. So either he should be poots. He'd be poots because he's a pig. Do they both start with P? Yeah, fine, he'll be Poots. He's my he's my co-owner of this restaurant. Let's call him Poots. <laughs> you belong with us now, little cutie. We're just adopting this guy? We don't know if he's someone else's. Hey, what's he holding in his mouth? Ooh, what's this? An envelope full of money. Wow, good thing we kept him around. It looks familiar. I think it's some form of currency. Hmm. Oh, there's a letter in the envelope. 
It's starch, the currency we used back on Earth. Free starch. He's bringing home the bacon. It reads that the starch are offerings collected from altar donations up on the land of the living. They are then brought to the chefs in remuneration for feeding and appeasing the gods. Do we really need money down here? Oh, yeah. What can we use starch for, though? Ooh, our shift is starting soon. Better get back out there. Better figure it out later. Let's go. Ooh, the shop is now open. Let's check it out. Oh, click on the shop. What can we do? You can spend your hard-earned favor. I don't spend the starch. <laughs> to purchase newer, better stations. And this fryer will produce good quality fried potatoes if the sinner's malice is above 70. Definitely a level up from the basic fryer we have. Okay, so it won't... It's not a good fryer that will always produce good quality potatoes. It has to require the extra malice and everything. So now I should start really concentrating on making sure I'm matching people. Like, sometimes if it was 70, 65, 65, I would just choose anywhere to place them. Now I should really start focusing on making sure I'm picking putting them where they absolutely deserve to be. Making sure they're enjoying the right eternal torment before they get eaten. It's not really eternal, it's pretty quick actually. It takes about five seconds. Yeah, cool. Cooking a dish with good ingredients will result in a higher rank, which gives you more favor. It all makes sense, it all comes around. Higher rank dishes also give more god XP points. They will give you special blessings as they level up. Looks like Loki leveled up. Hover over Loki's panel to see his blessing. Station processing time, 2% better. Cool. I'm going to let you decide when to upgrade the stations yourself. Where's the other girl? I'm the cook. You're the one who tells me about things. And what about the girl? Deetra, or whatever her name was. Let's start our shift. What did people ask for the most? What, what came up very commonly here? I got lots of boiled potatoes, but that seems to be because people don't really use them. People haven't really been asking for those. Fried potatoes seems to have come up pretty often. Let's just get the fried one, sure. And, well, obviously I'm going to replace the basic fryer. Station is currently processing a sinner. Are you sure you want to place it? No. Uh, all right, let's unpause for just a second. Let those cook. And then now we can repause it. Now I'll replace it. Yeah, I mean, considering it only takes a few seconds, I might as well, right? And and let's uh, let's replace our baking oven too. Why not? Might as well get two goods since we have all that favor. Oh, although oh, my goal for today is just fulfill three orders. It isn't even having a certain amount of favor. So yeah, sure, stick with it. So right off the bat, I'm gonna get good quality fried foods and and a good quality baked good. And then from here, I can just stick you guys whatever. It doesn't really matter. I threatened an old man because I have no morals. <laughs> it's weird that he like is uncertain about what he did, but he's like, I probably did it. See gameplay stats. Circle progress, 33%. Recipes unlocked, 20. Dishes cooked. Game progress, zero. I've done nothing. Sitters sorted, orders completed. Bailey's brewed. At some point, I'm actually going to brew Bailey's. Okay. Silence of the limbo. I wonder what the I wonder if that's what this circle the, oh no each part of each circle must have its own name. All right, well let's whip up our last few dishes here. We got three three things to cook. Have you even asked for anything yet? I don't think he has. I don't want to start cooking until he specifically asks me to, right? All these sinners, they basically all are over 50 of everything. No one very rare I see anything under 50. Oh, it's dinner time. Now he'll start asking for things. And he just wants, like, a heap of mashed potatoes or something? Bowl of mashed potatoes. It just requires two mashed potatoes to make that. I only have okay mashed potatoes. I haven't gotten anything other than that, so simple enough. Don't think about how they were made. Ouch. You can have your delicious potatoes. Can I skip sorting someone? Like, if all of these finish cooking up... Oh, he's already, he's already wants... Oh, he just wants something containing uh, the the baked potatoes. It doesn't really matter what it is I give him, huh? Well, let's give him something baked potato cubes. I'm going to use my two okay potatoes. How do you feel about that? Oh, wait. Good is better than okay. All right, well, I purposefully just switched him to shittier potatoes then. P equals MC squared? <laughs> I'm sorry that I accidentally gave you the worst... The worst plate of potatoes. I thought 
I was, I thought I was upgrading you. You say not hashtag shabby worthy. So that means it's, it's better than that at least. Oh crap. So I'm not going to be able to make uh, a good potato with this one. And shit, this is what I was wondering. Can I skip this guy? He's a dud. He's not going to make a good potato as is. I farted on a goose. I guess I just have to, I guess I just have to not cook all four ingredients for like the first time ever. So you will get uh, just a bunch of bowl of boiled potatoes. That sounds like literally the least appetizing meal. There's nothing wrong with boiled potatoes, but just a bowl of boiled potatoes. It's, it looks like there's a little onion on them or something at least. I wonder if there's a whole alternate side of hell where there's onion people that are cutting each other up, frying, frying each other up, and then sending them off as uh, little things to sprinkle on top of our delicious potato people in our potato hell. Trouble, trouble, boil and bubble. And let's do our last few little cooks here. Ah, perfect. Got the perfect assortment of it that time. Is my hell pit running out a little bit? That's what this little hexagon is. It's about half full or half empty. It's really funny that they included that in there. Uh, did I know I give this to you after I cooked it? Sorry about that. There you go. Praise the devils. This looks amazing. He just wants another thing containing mashed potatoes. Ugh. Is there anything that uses mashed potatoes and boiled potatoes? Because that's what I want to serve you. Oh yeah, perfect. Potato croquette. That's what you're getting cooked. Oh, I could actually, I'm going to upgrade one more of my things. I might as well. I have, uh, I have enough. And, and I'm not trying to save up favor for this particular level. I'm just trying to feed this guy. So might as well do it. This is the last order. Daily report complete. 19 centers sorted. Four dishes cooked. Four orders complete. Favor earned. Oh, good. It, it counts the total that I earned, not what I ended the day with, because I had spent some of it in the middle of the day there. Perfect. We can get ready for the next stage. But that's actually where I'm going to set aside the game for now. It's fun to mess around with. It was fun to show off for you guys. It does seem like it's a fun game. Uh, it's going to start getting really fast and frantic. And in that case, it's going to be very hard to narrate, because it's just going to be like quick rapid fire decision making. And so I don't know if it'll make for a good extended series, because... I'll, I'll have so little to say because I'll be so focused on trying to actually play out the game. It's something that I wouldn't mind messing around with a little bit more. It seems like it's fun. Probably just going to stay as a one-off here on the channel. Let me guys know what you thought about it down below. Looking forward to hearing from you. The game is out now. It just came out. It's brand new. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.